And tickle this thing off. All right. Mm -hmm. uh, Norm, you done talking about your club members here? All right. Uh, I love my club members. Here we are with Norm's. Uh, oh, look at that. Look at that. Oh, my goodness. All right. This is going to be a wide. Doesn't work. Fair enough. Well, it gets right up, doesn't it? Do whatever you want. Nice. Look at that slow flight. A little hoveration. Norm is exciting the crowd. Okay, I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do a flip. You got let me if you. Got I got it. you. Nice. You gotta watch that battery. That is a it'll thrust flip. flip. Well, if you know, it'll flip around on you before you're ready if you got it in the right in the spot. Ooh, Norm's breaking some rules. Come on, just do a roll here and see how we do. That thing rolls in a box. It does. Wow, it just holds it up. Nice <laughs> aileron rolls. It's just amazing how slow you can go at certain things with that TV. Yes, it is. Very impressive. See so if you can do two flips when <coughs> you come see, back by. That's a, see, that's a 25 feet, but, and it's more milliamps, but two. So we can do back to back flips. I, yeah, let's pass the back to back. You got the one, one. You can't lose it. and two. Oh yeah. It flicked around sideways, but that's <laughs> that was the, good. The habit helps me train on that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not doing nothing exciting here. I'm just... <laughs> nice. Now that was interesting. Man. Very nice. I didn't even expect it to be there because I haven't tried this stuff because of the wind. I'm going to do a rollover. Yeah. Machiavellian carry. Come back around. And a bird attacking you. Well, I'll tell you, it's easy to film at this speed. I didn't think about that. It's yeah, you should have some good video. All right, thrust hover. Nice. And this is in zero wind. Oh. That should look good if you get that. The lower, we got it. slower in the mower. I'm just going to do a somersault. <coughs> would you say that would be a first uh, a beginner? Staff? It's a trainer, oh, yeah. Absolutely. You know, no professional would fly this. <laughs> well, I mean, if see, I bought it, would be a, a good first jet. This is a great jet. It's, if you're well, not, I can see that. If you're not used to the thrust vectoring part, then that'll get you. Oh, that's you. right. It, Can't <coughs> recommend it for a first jet. No. No. But this is where I press it, I smack, it'll fall right off the edge here. Well, I've seen you do that. Yeah. You know, oh, yeah. yeah. Well, I know, but look at this runway and look at the, the Viper uh, landing gear. The Avanti, Avanti. Dave, the Avanti's got the right here. I'd have to say the Avanti. Yeah? Uh, yeah. I got I mean, yeah. that the landing gear is yeah. the same as the, You see, uh, my the problem with this yeah. one is when I've, I've ripped the landing gear off seven times. I know. It's just, because it's not made for Now, but I love this bird on that. that I've been flying Palm Coast a little bit. Yeah. You know, when you get three and a half minutes, you don't get a lot of air time. But you've been in the air for five minutes. Yeah, but look, I'm I'm, look at I'm, that I'm off the stick. That's why. Is it got any flaps? Is it got flaps? No. Uh -uh. Oh. Doesn't need them. Yeah, there. With any jets on a grass runway, you're always going to have issues. But yeah, the Vipers. The, yeah, my F-18. I stopped flying it out here because every time I, I flew it, I had to. Yep. Just ripped it right out. Sure.
The wheels are too tight. Yeah, the Avanti has the best grass landing gear, but you're still going to have issues from time to time. Yeah. And then the big F-18, the wheels are too small for grass. Way too oh, small. Yeah. He's got one of those. Wait, oh, beauty. Trying not to rip them. Whoa. There you go. That was called kissing it there. Wow. What's that? Oh, I don't need no attention.